Now, ahead of the 29th Conference of the Parties of Azerbaijan Climate Advocates in Nigeria have called for a comprehensive monitoring and evaluation framework. They say this will help track the progress and impact of local climate initiatives across the country. New Central's Joshua Marai has more. As the world prepares for the COP29 Climate Change Summit, many in Nigeria believe it is time for the nation to join others in taking center stage so as to address climate change. With Nigeria significantly emitting greenhouse gas emissions and vulnerable to climate-related disasters, the need for effective climate action has never been more pressing. Climate advocates have called for early engagement to the policy makers to help drive meaningful change. We can also hold governments responsible for this adaptation commitment. You know, lobby Nigerian government. I feel like we should even do this pre-COP. You know, forming a relationship with the Nigerian government because most of the agenda that is taken into COP is already approved. You know, by the parliament in Nigeria before COP. The CSOs are more closely related to the grassroots communities. They are like a bridge between grassroots and government. They say the establishment of a robust monitoring and evaluation framework will help track outcomes of local climate action across Nigeria. Monitoring and evaluation um, framework should be established to check the outcomes of these um, local climate actions that are being taken to keep track, okay, are we making progress, progress like the NDCs and other um, initiatives that are put in Thank place. You. Thank you so much. The Speaking on the challenge of reporting climate change, some journalists say there's a need for capacity building within the media to help effectively create awareness on the effects of climate change. First, the media has to be aware. There's more. There's need for more capacity building for journalists to know these issues. I think so because I'm aware myself. I know there's a huge communication gap amongst my own community. So there's need for the journalists to know, to be more aware of these issues, so that they now can help highlight these problems the way they are and push into our people for them to take this action. As pre COP discussion gained traction, experts say that an informed media is essential to holding government accountable and enhancing public support for climate adaptation. In Abuja for New Central, I am Joshua Marai. Um,